front of the hose. legal mailing address. 
Okay. Yeah. She does yeah. She it's sends them, but she sends the return address to this house. So we need to do it a little bit better than that. And you can call the cops if you need to, ma'am. You can call the cops. Okay. Oh, Go ahead. I'll wait for them to. Oh, hold on one second. You have to... Okay. Yeah. So she will send you a letter by USPS with a return with address. address that's not a PO box okay. that has a legitimate return address. Sorry, sir. I understand. So she does that, then what? You will respond accordingly, correct? Yeah, well, I mean, I'm, I'm not trying to stay in her house, but the, the text messages and letters and emails, is, it's, 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 especially when the letters are addressed to her return address as this address. She addresses all the return address mail that she's trying to get me to have a conversation with her with the letters. She ret ret the return address is 1509 S Street Northwest. The house that Thelma Hogue owns. Mm -hmm. So I can't, I can't write her a letter back. I can't do anything. And so I, I've been waiting to do that. But go ahead and call the cops. She looks like she's calling okay. the cops now. Mm -hmm. Here come the cops. You can get all my information from Thelma Hogue. I'm asking you. I just put me and you are talking. She's not speaking. We're, we're not, we're yeah, you're talking. calling the cops right now on Heidi Granger at 1509 S Street Northwest. I'm upstairs in the second room. So here's the question. When she contacts you via USPS with a legitimate return address, that will engage the process. Well, of course it would. I'm surprised she didn't know that. Okay. I, I didn't, we Just send me a letter with the same letter. She can copy and paste that letter she's been sending me. So let me ask you this question. Do you know, you are aware that they are the owners of the property, correct? Well, that's what she says. I've never contested that. Okay. I just want to, I want to return an address so I can send her a letter back and she keeps addressing her return address to this. Do that. And then, is there anything else we can help you? I believe you've already helped me. I'm waiting for the DCPD to arrive thanks to your friend who wears the hijab. Uh, uh, this is great. It's me and you. I, I don't, we're not, please ignore her for the moment. Is there anything else we can do to help you, help facilitate you leaving the premises to where you need to go. That's what I'm asking you. That's the authority I have. So I'm asking you right now. Um, what else can we do to help you? You can use the number that Thelma Hogue used to contact me by okay. and text me and let me know that you're coming in through the gate. Okay. That would be helpful. It would, it would ease that tension you guys have when you're standing on the stairs and I open the door. Okay. That would be, you know, a, a good try. Okay. And then your friend who wears the hijab wouldn't have to call the DCPD on me. Because she would have already text messaged me when she was coming in, making sure I was aware of that. Okay, that's fine. But I'll wait for the cops now. Make sure that next time. Uh, but is there anything else we can do to help facilitate you? I don't know. I mean, just keep the conversation going. Get my number. Call me every day. Talk to me every day. I'm not trying to to uh, stay here, okay. and I'm not saying I won't talk to everybody every single day. And you can call the DCPD every day too, dude. Okay. Um, you know, but I mean, there's a point where we need to be adults, okay? We are, and that's why I'm asking you specifically. What else can we do to help you? I don't know, sir. I, I guess I'm going to not have answers for you. Okay, no, I'm willing, to, I'm willing to take back anything that we can do to help you. Is there some funding we can do to help you? Oh, no, I'm perfectly capable of doing that on my own. Okay, so we're in agreement that we'll, I will confer back with Mr. Cole to get you a letter from a USPS registered... Well, she sends them certified mail. She's she's at the post office doing a pretty good job, but the return address is always this address that she's mailing it to. So I can't respond. Well, she's mailing it to this address because you're, you're at... The yeah, but she's addressing it to Thelma Hogue from 1509. She's, her return address That's is this address. I will make sure we take care of that. If she wants to send two certified letters that I signed for, go ahead. One legally claiming that it's her return address, and then another where I can actually respond to her at. Okay. Well, well, she can send both letters. I'll sign for them. That's even got more teeth. Okay. Because I, I signed for them. They had to ring the doorbell. I mean, whatever she wants to do, I'm not trying to take over her house. But it, I, I'll be honest with you, it, it spelled that way because last month, and it, I'm not, again, this is not adversary. I'm giving you information that I'm aware of. You told another young lady nine days and that was last month or that Tashika. I don't know. I don't and it was Candace. Candace. Well, sure. Give me one second, please. So this Candace came 
And you told her nine days, that was last month. There's been multiple people coming. I remember the names of everybody. I had long, thorough conversations with them. Your friend, who wears the hijab, is the first one to call the cops on me, though. Okay. I, so. I mean, we'll take care of that. I, this is just me and you, the person now. I'm asking. So that was what was told. So. Yeah. And this kind of stuff, you guys can save yourself a lot of trouble. I'll just go ahead and put in writing where I stand with the Maho, the owner, to a proper address, and she has all the power there. I'm the little guy. I'm not trying to take over her house. She's the property we're owner. Here's what we're trying to do. We're trying to help you. If you need it. If you don't, then obviously, if you're going to vacate, we would like to know when that is. So I am shooting for the first of the month. Of August. Yeah. All right. And I'm, and I'm saying to you, I have the authority to help. Are you from a department of Washington? I'm not from any You're government just agency. a friend of the Mars. I am a taxpaying American citizen. That is a friend of the family who go way back. And I am here. And your uh, friend who called the police on me is another friend. Or she was a real estate agent. Yeah. That's what she claimed to be one time. Okay, I'm not, we're not talking about her. It's just me and you talking right now. Okay, so I'm just letting you know who I perceive as coming to help me. A woman who wears a hijab who told me she was a real estate agent who just called the police on me. And a nice, another man who was a friend of Thelma, neither of them work for the city of Washington, D.C. that I know of so far. Right. Right. Okay. I'm not into the video, so it's not okay. Really okay, nice. can this lovely woman wearing the hijab let me know when the cops are coming because I assume they'll use the key to it and be really helpful if I had an idea. There's no cops are coming, man. They're not, okay. They're, they're no All cops right. Are coming. Okay. I'm trying to work with you. Because the cops can text me. Any everybody can just text me before you just walk on I don't in. Have your well, get it from Thelma Hogg. It would be make everybody less tense. You don't even have to come up here. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I mean, it just makes much more sense. Just text me. Come on in with the key. I know you're here. We can talk. I worked out this morning. I meditated. I'm not tense. I'm trying to. Well, it's, it's it's a little tense, anxiety sort of thing when you're walking in. You have to go hard. Oh, hello, hello. Just text me and say we're coming in. Well, you can get it from Thelma. She said you had responded to them, so why, why would one think if someone has not responded multiple times? Yeah, okay, okay. And that's why we came the way we came. Oh, well, yeah, so now that we're talking, try um, texting me, but I, I might be arrested. I might be arrested thanks to your friend who wears a key job. Okay. What, what, what will I be arrested for? No one called the police, Ms. Williams. All right. So we're fine. We're, we can leave that alone and bury that. Let's get all the stuff on it at the same time. It's gone. I, what I'm trying to do it is I mentioned help from the outset. I am trying to help facilitate. Okay, sir, I understand it's very clear. If you want to write me a letter, you know, with bulletin points, I will really appreciate that. But I, I think I believe I understand everything you've said. Is there anything else you need? No, ma'am. I don't need to trouble you for the rest of the day. You enjoy the rest of the no, day. No, you can take all the time that you like. No, no, we just came to check on It's not my house anyways. Came to check on the mail. I don't see any mail. Uh, so we're good. I just wanted to confirm with you. So I will report back to the soul what you just told me. Yeah, a legal address. I mean, these P.O. boxes, these emails, these text messages, these return addresses. I can't contact her if she's sending all her mail, you know, post return to sender to this house. I can't do anything with that. Well, you have a contact number, correct? Right, but I, it's just with, with somebody like me who's in her house, yeah. the way it works is that I respond to her in writing with a legal address. That's how it works. Uh -huh. She has the upper hand. I'm the little guy. So I already know that. I'm not trying to squat her house out. Yeah, let me just say, there's no upper hand in Lori. We're, 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 just, we're just trying to facilitate so they can move, so you can move on and they can move on with their life as well. They don't live here. Yeah. That's unfortunate that the brother passed. That thing has happened. We're now just trying to move forward with our lives. Everyone is trying to move forward with their lives. I'm here to help facilitate. And trying to disrupt mine by calling DCP to yell me. I just told you. What was this for? A mental health check? I guess I'll find out when they come. They're not coming because she has not called. They didn't call anymore. She did not call. call. That's why I'm talking to you. She's not calling anymore. And I was taking that. I did not call the police. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I'm trying to facilitate this moving forward, please. Okay, sir, if there's anything else I can do for you, let me know. I will get it up. I will get the note from the soul. I will convey the information that you just gave me. And we will move that forward. Fair enough? Yeah. Fantastic. Enjoy the rest of your day, man. You too.
and uh, for great weekend. Five nine nine hijab Amazon deliver the next day. Well, I guess the cops are coming next. We'll find out what they respond for when they knock on my door. DCPD back in one five zero nine S Street Northwest. They just can't stay away. All in uniform with their weapons on their hip. He job is standing there looking lost. I'm supposed to film the heat job. There she goes, Nike. And for 99 Amazon. And that guy went that way. DCP is your turn. Come on over. Ow, oh, it uh, does not stink of courses down here. But it does stink where I was standing. Right there. And since we're doing this live video, which I will put on YouTube, it's not too dangerous because you know how that goes. Um, for the last 24 hours, I can tell this morning, every time I open the door, you come here, it's like this, whoosh. There's a corpse and it's really, really nasty. And it's, I believe, coming from here. Remember how I filmed, especially when we had a lot of action with the Thelma Hogue crowd? There's something they're dragging. <laughs> Oh, it sounds exactly like that, but heavy metal dragging and done describing. And ever since I've witnessed that stuff underneath these four boards, you come out of this door, it's just right here. It's a clear start, human remains of some kind of, or another, and the bathroom will be clear. But this morning, the bathtub, that drain, Ho, ho, ho. All that chemical smell. Ho, ho, ho. Yeah, sir, we're back. Friends at Thelma Hope. Calling cops wearing knee jobs. Uh, this was big time. DB is clear right now. Clear, but it's not. This is a decrepit building. And we got 599 Nike wearing gang members with plastic on their shoes walking down the street with 5.99 Amazon delivered the next day to And right now it's clear. So I'm waiting for the cops to cops to come and be all clear, no like stark evidence. But the day that they came with the key, right through here, it was stark evidence. It was 10.30 at night. They were tripping over this cat food and it was all through here, the chemical stench that they manufacture. So they manufacture the stuff here and these, uh, DBs and it's all true. It's, I don't make it up. That's why they're so obsessed with coming and coming and coming and calling the cops. We'll wait for the cops next. All right, bye.